welcome back. It's Donna. Welcome to Planning with Donna. Sorry, I missed, um, I think, what was it, day 15 of Planmas yesterday, but I had company, and so, therefore, it did not happen, and I just, frankly, did not have the energy to make that video up. So, as I had explained previously, if for some reason I was unable to do a day, you know, my apologies in advance. Just saying. Because sometimes you just have to live life. And all I can say right now, one thought is on my mind. One day away from vacay. I am beyond excited. And I'm talking beyond excited. All right, so let's get started. If you're new to my channel, welcome. Thanks for stopping by. I have a, um, uh, I don't even know what I have today, to be completely honest. I pretty much ripped up two other spreads. Well, I did, I, I got stuff down on the page and I said, mm-mm. Ugly, not feeling it. Just, I, I don't know. I've had an off day. I think we all have those. So, just so you know, um, this might be a complete and total, like, you might just want to scream. <laughs> so, because I just, I didn't have a plan. And I think it's pretty obvious that I didn't have a plan. And I just, like I said, I had two spreads down, completely different stickers, completely different. And basically just ripped them up and said, mm, not feeling it. I hope I'm putting that in the right spot because if I'm not, it'll be a little bit late. Yeah, I think it'll be okay. I'm trying I tried so hard, guys, to be minimal with these stickers this time and not drown the page. And, guys, you already know. You just know. Like, I like excess. Okay? Just saying. All right. Let's move on. You already know that. I'm not telling you anything new. Don't want to bore you with all details. I mixed up two different, well, I mixed up a lot of stuff. And at the end of the day, I'm not sure what I ended up with. Because this has been Hot Mess Express. I did use some boxes from Botanical Gardens. Uh, boxes from Autumn Blooms. And I think the stickers are from, yeah, the stickers are from Autumn Blooms too from Live Love Posh. Um, this was from, um, Beauty and Florals, I think, this sticker. And <clears throat> it was going, leaning towards green. And I had just done a green spread. And I'm like, they're going to think I've lost my mind. Which, you know, that's not a real stretch. But I was just like, no, nah, they're not going to like that. Two green spreads back to back. They're going to be like, you've lost it. And then... I want to put this, like I said, there's a method to my madness. And, you know, at the end of the day, you might just call it madness. I don't know if there's a method behind it at all. <laughs> I might just be nuts, so who knows. And, like I said, there was some green. And it was leaning real green. And then I thought, no, I need something different. So, I just thought, just keep experimenting, and this is what I came up with. So, you'll have to let me know if you think I've completely went over the edge or not. I think it looked pretty good when I got done. Could have looked a lot worse. And I forgot to put this up here. I really like this uh, washi. It looks like a green marble. Um, and I just, I really just, I don't know. I just think it added a little something to this spread. 
Remember not to pull your washi too tight because if you do, your page is going to pucker. For all you newbies out there that didn't know that, which, you know, you'd have figured it out real quick. So I went green and black here. So now I'm going to do black. That's semi straight. And this real bright, bright. Oopsie, fuchsia. I know this is a little brighter than this, but I did the best I could. So this is gonna go right there. Let's smooth that edge down. I love these florals, they are beautiful. And I just could not help myself. I stole this beautiful fuchsia and black butterfly from my Anna Bean book. If you haven't picked up her book, check it out. Um, and then after I got in her book, I was like, hmm, she has lots of navy. She has tons of boxes in that book. Nice boxes of different colors. So... Line this up, push it down. So when you push it down, it sort of makes that shadow effect go away around the edges. And we're gonna put this here. I'm trying to line them up where they look the same across, get a little unison going here. I'm not trying to get fancy or anything, just, just saying. Then I wanna put this over here in the corner. And um, I'm probably gonna have to cut that right there. Because if it goes in behind there, it's gonna look real stupid. And we're gonna put, please don't tear. Um, okay, call me fidget fingers. I would like to say welcome to my new subscribers. Um, I have had a lot of uh, new subscribers recently. Well, not a lot, but I mean, you know, more than one or two. And each and every one of you are important to me. And I just want to say welcome. If you've not been on my channel before, my name is Donna. Uh, I previously went by the handle uh, Donna Smith Wilson, and I just basically, it's the same, but I just say plenty with Donna because, you know, that's a mouthful. And I have, obviously, a planner channel. And in the coming, that is crooked, in the coming year, now this won't start until January, I will be doing a recipe a week. And I think, help me Jesus. Um, I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to rotate it. Me and this sticker are going to fight. And it's probably going to win. Because like I said, I've had a day. So when I do the family recipe, what I'm going to do is I'm going to have everything set up and basically do like a real buzz through recipe, how to do it. Um, and I just thought that would be something fun and simple to add to my weekly videos. So, be sure you stick around for that because I think it's gonna be a lot of fun. So here I found this big, beautiful, navy-ish box. And I'm just gonna put it right there. And I'm going to Take my scissors, and is that straight, or is that good? I'm telling you, I can't put a sticker down straight today, save my soul. Gracious. Oh, have you just had one of those days? I think at the anticipation of my vacation may do me in. 
I have never had this much time off in any job I've ever had at one stretch. And I can't even begin to tell you how ecstatic I am. You know, the fact that I'm going to get to spend a lot of quality time with my grandkids and my parents. I think I'm actually going to go over and spend the night with mom and dad. Um, when they, well, daddy took care of me. Um, when I had my knee surgery, we had a lot of fun, you know, so, and I think they really did enjoy it. I think they enjoyed having that company and somebody else in the house besides themselves. And so, I just really felt like it would be awesome. And then Christmas Eve, um, my, the kids, my kid, my daughter and her husband have to I think he has to work. I don't know. I know she does. Um, everybody basically is going to be busy. I'll just put it that way. And I told mom, I said, you know what? I said, let's do an old-fashioned Christmas. I'm going to come over and bring all of our favorite goodies. You know, like the big crock pot full of little smokies. And I'm going to make a cheese ball. And... Just, you know, the nibblies that we all know and love so well around this time of year. And I'm just going to hang out with my parents Christmas Eve and take their gifts over. And, you know, they tell me every year, don't buy me anything. And I'm like, I really wish that you would stop telling me that because that's not going to happen. Just saying. I mean, they don't get out and go anywhere. You know, my dad don't. He doesn't do that, you know. He's like, mm, we don't do Christmas anymore. But I do. And I love it. I'm thinking, is that going to be... Let me nip off this leaf because I think it'll look weird. Overlapping right there. But I think otherwise it'll be okay. I am in love with this spread. I like it. I like how it turned out. I think it's pretty simple. Um, this will be my first week here back to work. Um, but I just tried to bring some colors from here. The greens, blacks, obviously, and the burgundies. And I think what I would do, I'm not going to do it, but... You know, if this is too sparse of a spread for you, what I would do is just put some lines in there. You know, at the end of the day, you could just say, okay, I need some lines in here. Naturally, I can't cut that straight. Oh, I think I need a good night's sleep. I think I'm just completely overwhelmed. All right. Cute. Like, you could just, like, right here, you could put lines here some here. If you want to skip around and leave that blank, you could do the lines here, like here and here. Just have some little, you know, leave these two big boxes because you might want to put something else in there. And you can fill them in with lines or you could add a bunch more boxes. I just didn't want to do that because this is my social media part of my um, big transformer planner that I made in a previous video. And I I do a lot of tracking, and I wanted a lot of white space. So that, hence the reason for, you know, doing all that. So, take this little edge off of here. And naturally, it's not going to tear off. <laughs> Why would this be different than any other day? So, I think I'm actually going to finish up this video, and I'm going to go stretch out. And I think what I may do is I might actually go watch a Christmas movie. Just saying, I'm sort of in the mood for a Christmas movie. There. Try to use up every little thing that I have so that I'm not wasting. I have just a tiny little edge right here to nip off of there. And let's cut down the seam. And this here is all my stuff for 
I, th I don't think, I don't know that I filmed that. I've been doing, but some of my monthlies, I've just been decorating them and photographing them. Because, um, as I had said in a previous video, I struggle with the monthly spreads. Of course, I struggle with this weekly one this time. I like it. I think the vibrancy of having those major pops of color look look good without having a multitude of stickers, boxes, and stuff. I think you've got your pops everywhere you need them. I really like that spread. This is in my big vertical happy planner for the week of January the 3rd through the 9th of 2022. I hope that you enjoyed this video. If you did, please consider giving me a big thumbs up. It's completely free and it really helps my channel to grow. Subscribe, hit that big red subscribe button, hit that notification bell, and I will see you guys in my next video. Thanks to all my new subscribers. Hang out with me. We're gonna have a good ride in 2020. And to all my regular subscribers and OGs, Thanks so much for your continued love and support in 2021, and let's get started with 2022. Bye!